Hi guys, Magic here. So on this video, I'm going to show you all about pets in this game. So we're going to talk about how you get the pets, the basic of pets, different pet types, and different tiers as well of those pets. So first off, where do you actually get pets or how do you get pets in this game? So you can actually get pets by using the Windbell Summon. So a Windbell Summon will actually consume sacred Windbells. Sacred Windbells can be purchased on the store using 100 diamonds each. You can also get them from the Windbell Quest, Tavern Quest, redeeming your arena points, buying them from the Black Market, or even actually, you know, getting them from the treasure hunt. So if you're lucky enough, uh, whenever you're, you know, opening your treasure maps, you may even be lucky and get a secret, a uh, sacred windbell. Now, other than that, there is another uh, way to actually summon pets, which is the witch summon. The only difference is that for the windbell summon, it can give you from normal pets, which are two star pets, three star pets, 4 star and of course the 5 star pets while on the witch summon the only pets that you will get will be starting from 4 star pets 5 star pets and also pet shards as well if you would like to be sure that you will be getting a you know um, a guaranteed pet then you can use the witch summon however the material that you use for witch summon the prophet crystal is quite rare to get you can buy this from the block market you can actually get this as well from the starlight treasure or you can buy this from the shop deals if you go to the shop deals you will see that profit crystal goes for 240 diamonds for every piece however it is actually you know my personal favorite because i am guaranteed to get a pet a full pet not just a normal one or a, a three star pet so if you're really chasing to upgrade um, some of your five star pets to become six stars or let's say from a seven stars and higher then i believe that um which summon will be the best way to get your pets now what are the different types of pets here in this game now there are actually four types of pets so let's start off with the fire type fire types focuses on damage and also intelligence so fire pets are dealing magical attack to enemies and some fire pets also buff the um, buff your character to deal more damage so if you're a mage or a magic user it would be best to put fire pets on your support arrays with intelligence aptitude the next one would be the earth type pets earth type pets focuses more on support defense healing so um, the support type pets you can actually at least you know um, put one at least one in your main array to sustain your hp or to sustain the damage that you take so for the support array you can put them on any slot that will actually require defense or vitality for wind type pets these are pets that focuses on physical damage so they are more on the burst and dps type pets as well so if you are a physical damage dealer, then it would be best to put wind type pets on support arrays with physical damage, for example, strength, vitality, or defense as well. And lastly, the last type of pet are the fairy pets. So fairy pets are actually the most rare um, uh, pets here in this game. So at the moment, they have only released the fairy dragon. So fairy dragon will actually infuse or evolve um, the character in order to grant you different type of skills. So these skills are really good in battle, especially in PvP. Now, the most common mistakes that I see for new players what they do is they actually recycle these um, blue pets or three star pets thinking that it's better because they will get um, pet XP. The thing is pet XP can be you know taken from different daily quests or daily events so you don't really you know you don't necessarily have to recycle these three star pets. Instead these three star pets are actually important in order to upgrade more of your other um, four star or five star pets 
So as you can see here, I have a ton of uh, four star pets. And if you recognize this, so this right here, where is it? All right, so this right here is actually an R pet. So this came from a three star pet and then I upgraded it to four star. Now this will be a material to upgrade my four star SR pets into five star pets. So there you go. So again, just to remind you, do not ever recycle your three star pets because you will lose a lot of chance to actually upgrade your higher tier pets in the future. So I will be I will be discussing more tips and guides for let's say different classes and pets that are suitable for you on the next videos to come. Watch out for the next video. Thank you and see you in game. Cloud Song, pre-register now.